I am here with former RFA world champion, current LFA contender, Tiago Moises. Tiago, how's it going, man? I'm great. How are you? I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. Thank you for coming on. Uh, I'm really looking forward to your upcoming fight. You'll be fighting Jeff Peterson, main event of LFA 41. How does it feel to be back in the cage and uh, in yet another main event fight? You know, it feels good. Uh, I'm really happy with LFA. Uh, really happy with my next fight. This is what I love to do, you know, so really happy that uh, I have a fight now. Now tell me a little about who you're going to be fighting and what do you see in his game? I'm going to fight Jeff Peterson. He's from Alliance MMA. It's a really tough guy, you know, uh, we're rounded guy. Uh, he's good on striking. He has he has good takedowns, good wrestling defense. But, you know, I'm better than him everywhere. So I'm going to show this on June 1st. Uh, I'm gonna mix everything, you know, striking, be aggressive, be on his face on 15 minutes, uh, use my takedowns and uh, my submission skills also. How does this fight end? Because I remember some of your great fights, especially when you fought in St. Louis, you're very well-rounded, you're able to finish fight anywhere and you're able to come up with some crazy, awesome submissions. Uh, and he's also a good fighter, as you said himself. How does this fight end? Yeah, yeah I'm gonna finish him first round. By what? TKO. TKO? TKO. Awesome. TKO. <laughs> awesome. I look forward to it. Now, uh, where does the win put you? Because he's on, I think, a six-fight win streak. And you're obviously, you've been a top contender for a long time. So where will the win uh, put you in MMA? For sure, uh, I want to be in UFC by the end of the year. You know, that's my main goal. The, I have a couple setbacks. Uh, like, last, last two years in my career, I had, like, couple injuries you know I had three surgeries in my right hand so that that uh, took me out of her a little bit so I'm ready to get back on track now how's your uh, hand now feels good now feels great and I'm ready to be a hundred percent on the occasion very cool very cool now talking about the UFC is there anyone on the UFC roster that you would like to fight uh, you know as soon as you get signed I uh, mean, I, I would like to fight anyone, like, in the UFC, you know, so just to want to be there by the end of the year. That's my main goal. Now, talk about your preparation. How have you been preparing for your upcoming fight, uh, and where are you training? I'm training in Coconut Creek, uh, American Top Team, right now. Uh, I train twice a day, every day. Usually, I go to the gym uh, in the morning, like 11. Mm -hmm around 11 uh, then do my first session like then get back home eat you know rest recover and go back to the gym like six o'clock now for fans who haven't seen you uh, compete yet I mean obviously you've had some great fights but for the fans who haven't seen you fight what should they expect to see from you when watching you in the cage like they can expect like the, uh, an aggressive fighter you know, uh, very skilled on on the ground. A lot of a lot of uh, submission skills. Uh, aggr aggressive on my feet. You know, like outstanding fighter. You know, just doing different things. I wanted to uh, briefly talk to you about your last fight against Robert Wa uh, Watley. Uh, what are some things you took away from that fight? Like, what did you learn in that fight? You know, last fight. Uh, I was coming like from three hand surgeries. Uh, you know, my head was was not there. I don't know what happened. My body was not feeling good. You know, so uh, I also trained too much. Mm -hmm. So I think I was a little bit overtraining as well, and that's why I was I wasn't able to perform as I can. Gotcha. Gotcha. Now, who would you like to thank? I'm sure you have a whole team, family, everyone who you'd like to thank for this upcoming fight. Uh, for my next fight, I'm getting a lot of help from my teammates, my coach at American Top Team. I'd like to thank everyone from American Top Team, as well my sponsors who made this possible, my wife, my family, and all my friends. Tiago, how can people find you on social media? Yeah, they can find me Thiago Moises MMA as on Twitter, Instagram, and uh, Facebook.